tough. Tough you have a run for Zagu though. Right. This is a uh, it's a lot of momentum that Zagu's coming into this. Uh, oh this yeah, too. yeah. The, you, so you get that's definitely gonna be a factor in this matchup. Right. Like, you, like you saw, you saw he's like kind of you know bouncing. He's ready to go. He's bouncing. He's like I just want to play. I want to push buttons. He, his inner slam shady is like showing. He's like, <laughs> I'm ready. I'm ready to get greedy. I'm greedy, baby. We're not gonna see the 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 crazy options though. We're definitely not. Like the crazy degenerate options. All right, so we're getting right into a case of looking super composed, though. When doesn't he? You're right. He's always been one of the most common composed players in this scene, even in Smash 4 days. Mm -hmm. We'll see what he can do here. Zigu going to find the first grab. And Kane, a solid 30% oh. combo with all that drag down. He thought that he was going to detonate C4, so that's why he went for yeah, the yeah. meter. No, but Kesa didn't really have a reason to in that right. situation. Ooh, oh, come here. okay. Give it the reset. I'm down with it. Okay, there, there's what he wanted. Very, very smart. He's got the Arsene now. He's got Aegon just being a monster already. Dante's going to start something up here. Just zoning him, zoning him out with movement and Aegon. Ooh. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, Zagu, you need to calm down that a little. That was the downiest down air I've ever seen. He literally almost has teeth because right. of it. That's how, that's how down it went. You know, you, you got to respect the bravery. Right. Oh, that's that bravery right there, too, to just come up with the Rebels Guard. That was so good. Aegon, did you get, get, relieve that ledge pressure? And Zagu, staying mindful of the C4. Right. Uh oh. Not too mindful of the C4. Not too mindful of the grenades, though, but going to find a back here if KSF jumps from ledge. Yeah, most of the time, case of it, this is uh, Snake in general is going to have to jump and try and get the grenades and C4 set up. Ooh, the air dodge on the ledge. Zagu going to punish it beautifully. Very high recovery, though. Be, be reversed to mix up his mix up the landing. Look at it. Look at him prowling this bottom of the stage here, too. Zagu does not have anywhere to com come from above. He has to come from him from the sides. And you've seen a lot of Zegu's approach options have been the short-up back airs, the short-up forward air, short-up nares. Short-up Aegon. Yeah, short-up Aegon. So if you can have this no-fly zone that KSF's trying to set up, oh, my gosh. I saw that. I saw. He was 180 degrees from danger. Right there. He's one turnaround away. But, yeah, KSF's just making sure that the aerial option is not the option he gets hit by. All right, back air to catch the roll. And Zegu trying. Oh, Ooh, okay. He caught the beer reverse, too. That was so sick. Try crossing up with Bear, but okay, Bear barely gonna die from that. It, the DI looked good, but it's just he was just at too high of a percent. He's gonna get some meter for it. Case of trying to get greedy there, baby. But Zagu is just like that's cute. Yeah. Oh, he's gonna get a ton of meter off that C4. Yeah, too. and he's already got Arsene back. Ooh. The down smash actually catching Arsene. Ooh, not gonna get him there though. Four tilt, but uh, going the other way. Zagu back with a little bit of damage too, but we'll take it. Yeah, he's as long as he's able to rack up enough damage. He's already at fifty. He's already got fifty on Kesef. Right. And Kesef's got to play the play the patient game here. Still, he's still got four minutes though. But Zagu is just like on another level of aggression right now. Some shield pressure at least. At least he didn't get any meter off of that C4. No, he did not. Oh, but he catching the jump was up tilt. Kesef back right back in it. Triple jab gonna get punished with the back uh, back air out of shield. Yep. The, he tried landing with the Rebels Guard, but yeah. Kesev able to back off properly. Oh, oh he, he, was, yeah. <laughs> he was waiting for some kind of defensive option. Nikita. All right, the dash attack there catching, getting him some stage stage control. Just the grab release, too, sending Zagu off stage, but really high as well, giving him the option to go above Kesev and get away and back onto stage. Oh, he, he, he was feeling it. He was like, I need to end this now. Looking for the grappling hook there. Not going to find it. Kesev going to punish on this platform. Down air, forward air. Okay. Maybe he thought the DI wasn't good enough for up it. Right. Oh, okay, yep. Good spacing on that bear. It was the pressure on short hop, too, that he was putting out, waiting for Kesev to pull a pin of a grenade, and so he could go forward. Even if he wants to take that trade, he's winning that. Yep. Very nice game one from Zagu, yep. though. And it's not like it was just... 
him out no, playing it, there was a game plan very, very far in advance for this snake. No, he was conditioning to see how how Kesef right. was going to re react to all that short hopping. Absolutely. And at that moment, Kesef wanted to try and break out of the break out of there with the grenade because that's a great combo breaker. Right. But like you said, Zagu pressured him with that short hops. Once he saw the pin, he just he just let it let it rip. Right. Kesef really thinking about this, and Lilad is the pick. Now, I definitely think that's one of Snake's best stages. It's like being trapped in a box with, like, a, like, a lion. You can't run. You can't. You can't you can, all you can hope is, like, you can dodge it enough, but in the end, it's going to catch you. Right. A caged beast is this Snake on Lilat. We will see if Joker can weather the storm and if Zagu can take this set going up 2-0. Right. We're getting right into it, though. And al already, you see that microspace and those little walks back and forth? Right. I love seeing that in Ultimate. And also, too, something that I'm now seeing as Kesev is recovering there, he can go under the stage to recover much more easily and avoiding a gun game or getting just any more additional percent from it. Yeah, I don't I don't really think the gun gimping really messes with Snake's upbeat. If, if he has the if he has the Arsene on, you never know. It takes a lot of percent. Okay, okay yeah, yeah. It's better to completely eliminate the option than give it any chance. You're right, you're right. Alright, All right, good dash attack to break to uh, get some stage control there. Mm. Grenade explosion, catching Zagu's landing. Talk about control though, Kesef taking that one right back after it was a very, very hot start from Zagu. Kesef knows that you could just camp those top platforms and force an approach from Zagu. Right, Rebels Guard to on the on the grenade. It, it's so smart, it's so easy. It's so, a kid could do it. Right. I bet that little kid could do it. <laughs> my man. My, my man, my my tri main K rule ICs Donkey Kong main. The legend. The legend. The myth. The truth. That was such a great way to start this. <laughs> right. But Rising up air from ledge. You're gonna even up these stocks, and not a lot of extra credit on uh, Zegu's part either. Nope. So. Ooh. Not a huge. Not a huge. Not a huge ladder to climb for Zegu. But Kesev is making it harder. He just he just racked up all that damage. I love how Kesev bounced the grenade off the tilt of the stage as well to get the angle on it slightly to get Zegu as he's trying to come up above the stage. That was brilliant. It was. It really was. Single hit forward tilt on shield. Going to get punished. I, l I love seeing Kesev mix up the F tilt timings. Like mm -hmm. whether, he, whether he either commits to the second hit or he waits for it to see what you're going to react with the... With the... Uh, with that till on block. Yeah. Ooh, not gonna die for it there too. That early. Was risky. Oh, that was so smart. Really good. Oh, okay, that down smash. Yeah, caught the jump. Yep. No, I, I saw Zagu go for forward air. It looked like. Oh, oh god. There is a lot of lag after you finish a rebels guard. So. Oh, Ksev SD. Wow, that was really unfortunate actually. Ksev smartly taking his time on the spawn platform, letting. Let try, you gotta let that meter run out right. as much as you can. Letting Arsene drain down ever so slightly. Yeah. This is such a high back air, too. Not many characters can contest Snake that high, but with Arsene, Joker can do about whatever he wants. Can he cut with an Aegon? Oh, I thought he was going for a forward smash. I, th I, I thought he was, too. Yeah. I was scared. Oh, he's too high for the up, for the up smash follow up. Okay, Zagu smartly just waiting. I like the running, uh, running the feint. The faint on shield, right, right. But Kesev was prepared Ooh, for it, and caught him. Zagu is up 2-0. Man, you got you're making me want to stand up. Like it's a, it's I actually the wave. You gotta you gotta get in the moment of smash. Like I'll tell you the lore behind standing up. All right, tell so, soon after this set, because this is a banger. Did I it? can't just stop thinking about this. I'm trying to think what's uh, Kesev going to do. Do you think he might go back to Lilat? I'm thinking he is. No. I'm thinking right. he is. I mean, the stage's already been picked. I unfortunately I, see I it. missed it, too. I, I wouldn't doubt if he went back. Right. Yeah, he did. Okay. Like I said, it, this is, I'd say, Snake's best stage. Right.
Cage Lion, right. and you're in there. And he's hungry. He's very, very hungry. Uh, he, he hasn't eaten in days. Right. KCF getting caught in the calamity of his own grenades there, too, taking a little bit of percent, actually letting Zegu get on the stage in the meantime. Ooh, okay. the reset with the grapple. <laughs> He's usually going for another aerial or something after that, too, so I, I really respect the air dodge read with that forward smash. Yeah, it was... It, he had it, too, but Kesev drifting away from the forward smash. Right. Really smartly. Holding this ground super well, but getting grabbed as he was sitting in shield there, too. The grenade was behind him, so he didn't have any protection on him. Trying to get cheeky with the grappling hook. He saw that. I, there isn't many characters that I see Joker get more Arsens against than Snake. Gosh. Like, per stock, he's oh. getting so many, and he's taking so much mileage for each single one. The forward smash. Perfectly spaced. Just caught right on the tip of Arsene's right. fingertips. Okay, the grappling hook coming through. On that up tilt, just missed. Ooh. Because you're trying to land. Oh! Oh, he yeah, he was too far. He didn't have a jump. Yep. The sour hit of Bear coming through once again. That's so much. That's like a third of that meter. Was, that was two thirds of his meter. Off of two grenades. And he has Arsene again. Welcome back. Welcome back, baby. Frequent flyer Arsene. Oh, he, I, he was waiting for that air, the directional air dodge, too. He just didn't react properly. Right. I love the get-up option with the guns, too, because he saw KSF didn't have a grenade in hand, He's catching the landing beautifully. Catching another directional air dodge. Zagu just taking his sweet time. And KSF, this yeah. is, this, usually you see a little bit of longer sets. It's only been three minutes. And, th and that's what I'm thinking here, too. Not many characters can force a snake to approach. I'm thinking, like... Any character with just the, the superior frame data, and then obviously you can build meter off all of his projectiles too, so. Yeah, this definitely makes it a tough matchup for Snake, right. it looks like. Forced to approach here. Oh my gosh. And is the disadvantage is too weak at times. He's going to go for a down throw here. Okay, Ooh. he went for the follow. I'm down. But yeah. again, Zagu is Ar Arsene. He doesn't have to approach. He can literally just wait. Gonna get caught with that big old hitbox of the up tilt too. He had, the, he had the good DI, he was just at a too high a percent. Right. He's gonna rebel scarred that. He's already got half his bar back. He's gonna go for a yep grapple. Oh, but a little too high. Ambitious though. Right. I think he would have gotten a lot of mileage though. First hit forward air into up air, creating this juggle situation here for Zagu. Working out extremely well. Ooh, gosh. Oh my goodness, Zagu. I love the runaway from K7 though. It's super smart. Yeah, he. Got to, got to take your time in these situations. Also, ooh, oh my goodness. I think right here, too, cooking your grenades as Snake might be the option, too, so you can force out an immediate uh, Rebels Guard so you can try to get that going. Obviously, that's going to be for our senseless Joker. A whole different beast here. Forward throw going to be the option. All right, Nikita. Parries Nikita. No one ooh. parries Nikita. Up tilt, roll up tilt. Ooh, first that's hit. it. That was such a beautiful hit confirmed for Zagoo. Oh, God. In and a clutch moment like that, that... God, that was so good. That was phenomenal, yeah. That was honestly a really dominating 3-0. Right, and I it, thought that was dominating. And it, it was it wasn't like he was playing a very simple game. It was dynamic. He was getting his kills in very, very different ways. Like that was the first hit confirm we've seen that entire set off those.